A historic building burned to the ground in Shreveport. Now fire crews suspect arson played a role in the tragic blaze. KSLN News 12's Destiny Patterson joins us from the scene. History resides on this quiet street in Allendale, but now char and rubble is all there is to show for it. Anger, first and foremost. The site, recognized by the National Register of Historic Places, was built by businessman and state politician C.C. Antoine. And he wrote the charter that incorporated the town of Shreve into the city of Shreveport. Pastor Willie Stewart is a neighbor to the C.C. Antoine house, preaching at this church every week. So I had to move my Bible study from 7 o'clock in the afternoon to around about 5.30 or 6 o'clock because we don't know who could be up in this building. He says he was frustrated with state and city leaders before the building burned down. I hadn't been inside. I've looked in the window because the building has what never... What did you see when you looked inside? Just trashed. I sat down with Councilwoman Tabitha Taylor, and she says she's been working closely with several other people, including Craig Lee, discussing plans for the house. Was there any sort of vision for it before it burned? Yes, it was. Um, actually, I was in a talk with a local historian, Gary Joyner, on Monday. It was not in the best state, and so what we wanted to do is to recreate the home. She says the fire only motivates their plans to move forward. We don't have a choice. To not honor him is a disgrace. How should have never gotten in this condition in the first place? Because they say it's about making sure the past is not forgotten. While there's not a whole lot left to salvage, both Tabitha Taylor and Craig Lee tell me they're hoping that they can use some of these leftover bricks in their next phase of honoring CC Antoine. Destiny Patterson reporting KSLA News 12. A Shreveport Fire Chief Clarence Reese also says this fire and three others may be linked in an arson case. Look for the first alert on air and through our KSLN News 12 app once we learn new details.